I've been a research scientist in ecology for more than 35 years now. All the work that I do is in the outdoors like this, in the hills on the uplands. One of the things that really motivates me as a scientist is being able to make a difference. It's almost like I'm a little cog in this big wheel of things that are going to really make a positive difference on the world in which we live. My name is Alison Hester. I'm a senior scientist at the James Hutton Institute and I'm head of our Climate Positive Farming Initiative. So Climate Positive Farming is a way to transform how we manage the land to address the climate crisis, but also to protect and enhance all the biodiversity that we see around us. And at the same time, of course, land managers need to make a living. So we're looking at how we can transform land management to get the maximum number of benefits for people who are living and working on the land. So here at Glensock, which is the core of our Climate Positive Farming Initiative, we're, we're trying to focus on key gaps in our knowledge. We have sheep, we have cattle, so it's a great place for research scientists to tackle questions such as natural flood management, peatland restoration at the higher hills, and trying to integrate livestock farming with the biodiversity that you're trying to protect and enhance. One of the things that we're really focusing strongly on here is combining transformations in land management with the application of new technologies. My role is to develop our climate innovation hub. Here we're bringing together people with interesting ideas to help develop solutions for some of the challenges we face in the future with climate change. My particular interest is in developing a range of technology solutions. You'll have seen Ashley there taking some water samples to look at water quality. This is really important because it tells us about the health of the aquatic environment. Here at Glensock, the companies can come in and test a new range of technologies in a real world environment so we completely understand the impact of what we're doing and we have evidence of the change that we're making. One of the exciting technologies that we're testing here at Glensock is green hydrogen. What we're setting up here is a farm scale demonstrator funded by the Scottish Government's Just Transition project as a way of demonstrating that you can remove all fossil fuel dependence on a farm with all its associated seven households and replace that with really clean green energy. So no more fossil fuel use, completely clean green energy across the farm and all the households. We're in the middle of big crises, climate crises and biodiversity crises, and land managers are really sitting right in the hotspot there because they are very vulnerable to climate change in particular but also by managing the land, they're also contributing to climate change if they're not managing it well. One of the things I really love about working in a big multidisciplinary institute is that real world problems need a huge range of disciplines working together to tackle them. And it's hugely inspiring to be part of a big team all working together, pooling their knowledge to make a real difference. If I can see that direct translation of what I do into a really positive impact, it's very, very rewarding for me and I feel that what I'm doing is worthwhile.